Where are we right now, bro? Right now, I think <laughs> I myself, James from Border Talk, <laughs> Femi from Border Talk, <laughs> we are the West Ham trainer ground yes. for the link up. And yes. Why are we here? Mm. Kate Longhurst, mm. Jared Bowen, mm. Robin, top Robin, players. Robin, 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 Robin. Yeah, he's Robin. Robin. Yeah, yeah. Robin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Top players. Epic conversation. What's happening? Okay. How's <laughs> it going? Yeah. Jared, what? Who's your role model? And why is he your role model? My role model in terms of... Oh, it could be a she. Right. My terms and role model away from, away from football is probably my dad. Okay. Because he was, he was my... Uh, he had like a local boys team back home where we lived and he was the manager. Obviously, you know, some street and all that. Yeah. Um, but now nah, he was like... And then ever since I've like, you know, got into football properly when, you know, I had a couple of setbacks and was going to give up football. And then for him to like get me in the mindset of continuing playing and you know I'm here now and you know, sometimes I look back and my dad was massively influential on in me and, and my mum as well. Like, you know, when she was driving me up and down the, the motorway on there and she didn't want it at all but you know, she's done it and I'm here now so everything's probably you know for them too especially I think. That's nice. And Kate, what would you say your happiest period of your life is in life? Um Probably when I was like 19, 20, um, I think just kind of getting to learn to be an adult and um, going out all the time. Oh, you're going out, yeah, nice. <laughs> going nice, out all the time, nice, can't nice. do it now, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. so. Um, but like football, was, it wasn't like full time for me and I didn't know that that could be a possibility. Um, but it was the first time that I was like, okay, I really want to be serious about football, but I also want to have a good time and can spend time with my friends, my family. Um, I was living at home, so it's, it was an easy life. And how did your like family take you playing football? They've always been really supportive. Um, I think because obviously when you're a kid, especially as a female, it wasn't an opportunity to to play full time football. Yeah. Or even really, not a lot of girls playing football. So they've always been really supportive of me and just want me to do whatever makes me happy. And football is what makes me happy, and, and that's why I'm carried on playing. Yeah, and, I, and it's good because now we see what women's football is becoming. Um, it's, just good, it's just good to see that, you know what I mean, you're getting all the coverage that you don't deserve to be getting now. Yeah. So, so yeah, credit to you on that. You told me your favourite player off camera. Yeah. So who's your favourite player? <laughs> <laughs> Jared, why are you looking at her? Don't look Jared's looking at her like, don't yeah. Don't put her under pressure, bro. Speak your truth. Speak your truth. What I said was everyone was... It, I, I no, like everyone. No, Kate, Kate, you're, you're, Obviously, you're sitting on the fence. Okay, okay, don't okay, do okay. that, please. All right. Just say. Uh, well, They're all yeah, good players, we all know that, but who's your favourite? You can't say him because he stood next to No, don't worry. We but, no, <laughs> you were my three. I said, no, I said, I said, I said, Jared, I said, Antonio, and I said Rice. Oh, okay. And obviously no, because he's a legend. But, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm going to learn to Hereford whole, what would you say is the most challenging, um, challenging part of your career so far? What would you say that is? There's a couple. Um, obviously the one that sticks out is when I got, you know, rejected from Cardiff and then, Kind of was just going to sack football off because you know, okay. about going into a Hereford, you know, we're yeah. struggling with finances and the youth team scholarship was yeah. talking to get him. So there was a there was a stage where I got rejected from Cardiff yeah. and then I had no like kind of youth team plans. So I was like, oh, you know what? I just sack it off. I'd be with my mates and that. And then yeah. that's when I said earlier about my old man just being like, nah, honestly, stick to just it. Just keep going. Yeah. So keep probably going. from there or when I was at Hull, I got took out of training and stopped uh, training for like six months because. Yeah going for non-league you have no like there was no like uh, gym or meter or all these kind of things <laughs> like a structure and like a yeah. routine of it you just kind yeah. of turn that if you had an injury it just put some ice on it and <laughs> all the typical stuff it gets so, like that it gets like so that. when i went into you know full-time training at home mm. you know my, my ankles um were struggling yeah um, and i had a lot of injuries mm -hmm. so then it was kind of a decision to you know I was, they took me out of training for six months and i was fuming <laughs> i was like what are you doing but yeah then, Looking back at it now, touch wood, I've, I've been injury free and I felt I felt good. So probably those yeah. two times were probably oh, the most challenging, yeah, I'd say. Challenging my career. Uh, you're out of it now, though. So. Yeah, yeah. And you're touch flying. Wood, touch wood. <laughs> you're flying. Keep it going. <laughs> keep it going. <laughs> keep going. Keep going. How would your friends and family describe you in three words? So I'll give you a little think. Energetic. Energetic one. Nice. Um, 
loyal. Loyal. Oh, we love loyal people. Yeah. And that's really it. Mm. And um, I mean, they they probably say funny, but you can't say it yourself because you, you don't. Yeah. Would you, you know, say funny? But, would you say I'm funny? Yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah I'm funny. funny. Yeah, actually funny. Now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> no. I'll take that, <laughs> and then I'll, I'll say that. Energetic, loyal, and funny. Yeah. Or fun love, like fun loving. I'll say fun loving. Jared, your turn. You? Probably boring, because I just sit at home most of the time and play PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> um, PlayStation, what's your favourite game? New CODs just come out, I've been bashing oh, okay. that. Or oh, a bit of FIFA. I'm on FIFA, okay. like every night FIFA. Yeah. But new CODs come out. Okay. Mm, first to choose one, FIFA. FIFA, yeah. FIFA, I reckon yeah. like in another world, I like, well, find myself gamer, with FIFA, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, okay. like, I'd love to do it. Obviously not now, but yeah. I'd love to do it. <laughs> if I was in another life, I'd choose. So, so you got boring. <laughs> <laughs> um, What's the other two, bro? Uh, I'd probably say, they'd say I'm humble. Because humble. they all say, humble. you know, okay. from where, from where yeah. I am now, they just see me as the same. Same. You know, yeah. I'm, and that's the way I am. I just yeah. act the same. So be the same. Um, and so boring, probably bad. Right? <laughs> Humble. Um, uh, another word. I don't choose. What did you say? Loyal energy. I can't say the same. Loyal energy. Yeah, no, you're the same. The same. Could say funny, but. I don't know yet. Yeah. I'm not I'm sure funny and boring go in the same. Yeah. Yeah, but there's like boring. Dry like, humor. Within yourself, uh, and like okay, funny okay, within okay. like the, the same people. I probably sound quite shy, you know, like, yeah, yeah really. Like, oh. um, like, when I first, obviously, when you first move clubs, it's you know, you're walking around like you're yeah, on trial yeah, or yeah. something, yeah, yeah. but even still, like, in like big groups now, I'm just like sitting, like, just observing uh, okay, everything. I don't like, yeah, 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 you know, when there's banter flying around and people are like caning mm -hmm. people, I'm not like jumping at someone, so I know yeah. it's coming back. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If I dip my toe in, I, I'm in, I'm in, yeah. I'm in the door then, so. Yeah, probably shy, you know. I would say, yeah. yeah. I would say because, you know, not with my family and stuff, a little bit. Um, yeah. But they're probably three, I'd say. Probably not painting myself a good picture here, but. Yeah. <laughs> that's all right. But that's what I'd probably say if I'm being honest. No, nah, nice. Nah, I get you. So it just sounds like you're someone that just manage your own business, yeah, gives yeah, yourself yeah, to yeah. yourself, yeah. Myself to and myself, stay out of yeah. people's way, which is cool. Yeah. Which is cool. Nothing wrong with that, bro. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> people say you lot strip like, make trips like. Old fashions like. Let's use, let's use the word drip. Drip, drip. Let's use the word drip. What's, what's mine? Drip means yeah. fashion, basically. Like, dresses, dress sense. Dress, uh, dress sense style. I mean, if you see me day to day in training, mm. then probably not very good because I literally just put on tracksuit bottoms or something that's warm, especially the weather now. Mm -hmm. Then I just put on whatever's, whatever's there. But on it, like, I think I dress all right outside of football. Yeah. I would say people say I dress all right. Not like, I wouldn't say like, Oh wow, so shit! Like people won't go. Oh, she like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's got yeah. good fashion, but I think I think yeah, they think I dress okay. Yeah. And Jared, what about you? Same like day to day training. You know, you're not gonna wear a pair of like maybe jeans like bomber. You're not wearing yeah. it for training. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You don't need to wear it to train. So day to day is just more like like Kate said, like track suits, like chill wear, yeah. but not just like you know your pajama tracks. It's where you come in and like, everyone's gonna. You've got to yeah. take your pyjamas yeah. off before you come in. It's got to be like a decent, yeah, yeah, yeah. like a decent tracksuit, yeah. A decent tracksuit. Um, who, would you, who would you say is best dressed in here. the team? Um, I just see, um, who do we just see? Lanzini. Lanzini. He look good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's good. Jeans are a bit high though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Best Arthur's good. Yeah. Arthur dresses well. Masawaku, yeah, he dresses yeah. well. Deck as well. I think we had this conversation before. Deck said me and him, like, are into like the same kind of the kind of clothes and okay. maybe it's like around the same, yeah. the same age, you know, it's like drip big now, I don't know. Yeah, 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 it's, 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 it's a big deal. Yeah, but Arthur, Arthur, I like the way Arthur does. Now, yeah. who would you say is the worst? The worst? <laughs> oh. Nah, it's got to be, and I, I love him to pieces. <laughs> there's, there's a couple and they're from the same country. <laughs> maybe, I don't know if anyone can, can guess, but... Oh, um, I think I know you're talking about. I don't know who. I don't know who. I let you talk about. I'm gonna let you say it. Go on. Go on. Look, I wouldn't say, no. They might think. You know, I'm not saying that they look like a bag of yeah. rubbish coming in every day. But it's just maybe because it's not. You know, Your you're style. used to English. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not my style. So it's not for not for me. Yeah. Um, to probably be like lad or Tom. <laughs> because. Listen, for me, it's not what I'd wear. For them, it might be. They might look at me and think, "Oh my god, he looks awful." I think it's because they don't care about 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, just the they just want to run around the pitch or something. <laughs> that's, yeah. it. Yeah. that's it. Yeah. That's it. That's yeah. it. That's it. But no, nah, okay. but like I said, they might look at me and think, "What are you wearing?" Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, you yeah. never know what's in what's in someone's mind. But no, nah, I probably just if I was ha- if I had to choose. Yeah. That's no disrespect. I love them pieces, but where would you like go to eat? Yeah. What's your go-to restaurant? What's your favourite type of food? I. Where can the fans catch you? <laughs> yeah, McDonald's. Yeah. I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. I actually, like, I'm, I quite like Wagamama's. Wagamama's, like, yeah. Like, just a cheaper option. You know, like, yeah. just... I don't know, I like noodles. Yeah. So, nice. I, yeah, I like Wagamama's. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, me, sometimes I'll just, you know, if I, I don't really, like, go out, like, after training that much. But if it's a weekend and, like, Say we've won a game or something, um, and I'm going out. I've been to a couple of places, but Monkey House was nice yeah, when I went there. Yeah, yeah. Nice. That was nice for food. But then if it's like, I don't know, you've got a day off or you just want to walk somewhere, Nando's comes from Monkey House. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Touch. yeah. 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 Monkey House and um, another club as well. They're like my two that I've been to. But I haven't really been to yeah. that many. Like since I've come here, it's kind of been, it was locked down when I, when yeah. I first signed. Yeah. So I had like a year and a half of everything closed. So now it's only just open. I need to go and see some more but they're my two that I've been to that I thought yeah these do you, do you see a lot of um, different in, in restaurants from being up north and from being in, in, in London yeah massive difference it's yeah. a joke down here yeah but uh, <laughs> now nah, yeah it's, you know, it's been in capital innit it's just mm. like even just like the energy of people and like just yeah. the feel good factor you go out and everyone's just like just loving it innit it's just yeah, like when 100%. people are there you can just kind of 100%. work off the energy so, nah, it's, it's good. so where, where would you say in touching on obviously Restaurants, where would you say you, you guys like to go for shopping and get stuff to buy? Clothes? Um, I mean, I'm a, I think because of lockdown, I've got used to just online shopping. Online, yeah. A lot, online shopping. You know? Um, Amazon. But yeah, I mean, I honestly, I do most of my shopping online. Is it, I'm yeah? like, I don't like walking around the shops mm. and trying st- I never try stuff on, so I bring it up home. And I'm like, oh, I should take it back, and then yeah, it just yeah, stays yeah, with yeah, a label yeah, yeah. in my wardrobe for yeah. a while. Yeah, that's that's right. Online shopper. Yeah, yeah. Like, I just usually do like a, like I don't order nothing for a few months. I'm like, right, I'm gonna order bulk, and then I've got it for a few months, yeah. and then it's like okay. winter seasons, and you're like, right, it's, summer's coming up, I'm ordering in bulk mm-hmm. for summer, yeah. and then you go in. But for shops wise, as in different shops, I only because I went there a couple of weeks ago. But obviously, when you go down go down uh, Oxford Street in London yeah. and you go yeah. in and you just like walk in you just pick, yeah. some, pick a couple things up yeah um, I went there with my family the other day and it was yeah and like again it's just so yeah. busy all the time busy. though isn't it yeah. like, it's just so busy yeah. Yeah. It's true. Like, it could be late it could be early morning but it's just mm-hmm. it's just so busy but it's nice down there I like it down there yeah. as well no it so. is it's, it's great down there yeah, you yeah. said you went there with your family, yeah, which yeah. leads me to my final question. And be honest, okay. I need honesty here. Okay. Yeah, here both go. of you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Buying for yourself or buying for others? Honestly, <laughs> buying for others. I love buying for other people. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm so yeah. tight with my own. Like, if it's for me, I'm like, oh, I can't that much. Like, yeah. mm-hmm. and then if it's for someone else, I'm like, oh no, they'd really like that. Yeah. You know, like I would much rather buy something for someone. And yeah. Especially for Christmas. I, so, like, I so, love buying for Christmas. So after this, um, what are you buying me? Uh, well, what do you need? Because I've said, so it's, I already said you that you're the best dress. Oh, so that's so, why you've done it. Yeah, yeah, you know I was going to ask you. I knew, so. But yeah, yeah. I, I definitely prefer buying for people. Yeah, buying for yeah, others like an occasions like birthdays and Christmas yeah. and that I prefer like buying. I'm gonna tell you I'm gonna everyone. tell you my birthday in the oh. Yeah 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 Christmas and birthday yeah yeah hundred yeah. 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 percent yeah. but then you know you do I do treat like buying for myself as well mm-hmm. I do like treating myself and I like, find myself some clothes which is nice. But receiving gifts off people I don't mind but people don't know what to buy for me they say I <laughs> don't know what to buy you like, my yeah. birthday and Christmas are literally like five days apart. Yeah, yeah, no way. And I'm like, right, I want birthday and Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> but they're like, we don't know what to buy you. Yeah. But no, nah, I prefer buying, like case of buying for other people. Um, yeah. It's just a thought in it. And yeah. It's more, it's more fulfilling. Yeah, exactly. Well. Yeah. Or if you see yeah. something like and think well. of someone mm-hmm. that they would like that. Yeah. yeah, or, yeah, you pick it up from, yeah I yeah. know, like, my, I think, oh, my mum would like that. Then yeah. I just get it. But. 100%. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, listen, thanks for taking the time thanks out. For taking us. And, um, now we just need to sort out our presents. Yeah. After this. <laughs> but it's, Give me it's your address. Yeah, and all that. it's been amazing. We appreciate you guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate you guys always, man. Love. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.